Hi, welcome back to Cooking with Grandpa. It's a cold day out in the winter right now, so we're gonna make a little hot chocolate for the grandchildren. I'm make, gonna make a quart of milk. It's enough for four people. You can cut the recipe in half when you look at the ingredients in the description. Let's get started. Okay, we got about seven tablespoons of cocoa we're putting into a pot. And we got three tablespoons of sugar and we're going to mix that together and a pinch of salt we're going to throw in here and break up the cocoa as much as you can and I got about two ounces of water I'm going to put this in here a little at a time and I'm going to make a nice paste okay so now you see I made a nice paste in here looks good right now all you have to do is get this up to a little bit of a boil and you stir it up so that's just the cocoa sugar and a little water to make a pasty and as soon as this starts to boil you boil it for about a minute while you're stirring and we'll get to our next step okay so we got it on a nice low flame you don't want it to burn on the bottom but as you can see, it's it's kind of getting to a boil. Once that gets to a boil, you put in your milk. Now this is hot chocolate, homemade. Much better than any packaged hot chocolate you'll ever get. Now when you heat this milk, you get it up to about, you don't want it to come to a boil but you want it hot at about 180 degrees. Okay, now I've been stirring this for a few minutes. I told you I like to get it up to about 180. Here we go, we're good. No, we don't want it to boil. We'll shut the flame off. Put it over here in this hot plate. And I'm gonna throw some vanilla in. Stir it up. Well, the ingredients will be listed in the description below. Like I said, this is for a quart. And we have these nice mushrooms. Mushrooms, I'm sorry. We have these nice marshmallows with a heart. And we're going to put that right in there. Okay, thanks for listening, and I hope you enjoyed the hot chocolate, and happy Valentine's Day. And don't forget to subscribe.